Alright guys, in this video we're going to talk about how to write the first five terms of an arithmetic sequence. So this is fairly straightforward. Um, so just going back to our last video, over here in the top right hand corner we have the equation um, for an arithmetic sequence, okay, where a of 1, that's representing your first term of the sequence, okay, n is going to represent the number of the term in the sequence, and D is representing your common difference between your terms, okay? So we can see here that we're provided with our first term, which is A of 1, and we're also provided the common difference, okay? So in order to find the first five terms of this arithmetic sequence, we first start with our first term, in this case A of 1, which is going to be 15. We know that our common difference between all our terms is going to be negative 5, Okay. So our next term here in the sequence must be 10, right? The difference between the two is negative 5, right? Then our next term, that's going to be 5, okay, then 0, and then negative 5, okay? So here are our first five terms of our arithmetic sequence, and if we want to go a step further, let's find the equation of this arithmetic sequence. So here we're provided, right? the equation for an arithmetic sequence, all we have to do is fill in our values and then just simplify, okay? So, we're going to go ahead and rewrite this. We have a of n, where n is representing any term in the sequence, okay? Then we have equal to a of 1, we know is 15, plus, then we have n minus 1, and then our common difference here is going to be negative 5. Okay. So let's go ahead and just simplify this down. So we get a of n equal to 15. And we get plus. So we're going to go ahead and distribute in here. We're going to get a negative 5n, right? And then we're going to get plus 5. Okay. Let's go ahead and combine our like terms now. So we have that here and here. So a of n is going to be equal to 20. So we're done with these. And then just minus 5n. Okay, so we can use this following equation okay, to calculate any term in this given sequence. Okay, so again, if I want to find, let's say, the fifth term in this arithmetic sequence, well, we know that's going to be 1, 2, 3, 4, 5, right here, right? This is going to be my fifth term. So let's see how that works out using our equation. So I'm going to say here a of 5, meaning I want to find the fifth term. So a of 5 equals 20 minus 5 times, again, I want to find the fifth term, so I'm plugging a 5 in for n. Okay, so a of 5 is going to be 20 minus 25, which we know is going to be a of 5 equal to negative 5. So here it is. Okay, so again, you can see how we can use this equation to calculate any term, okay, in this arithmetic sequence. All right, and that is it.